Debbie is here to reveal her results along with plastic surgeon Dr. Greg Mueller. Let's see her new look. Yay! <laughs> was it worth it watching what you went through? Um, <laughs> yes. I didn't realize how bad it was, but if you look at the photo, it's amazing. Very, very natural looking, which yeah. is what's really impressive. It's just you, I mean, you look more youthful, but very natural. All right, so Doc, little shop talk here. Yes. How, as you see it, what's the biggest difference between what you did for Debbie and our more traditional, classical face neck lift? Sure. So what we did with Debbie is we actually sewed her neck muscles using a lighted needle and thread. And you all saw that light, light. coming through the skin. That enables us to lift and support the muscles without having to surgically open the neck. Now you saw me remove a little bit of skin, so we do a little bit of a skin tuck around the ears, but no opening of the neck in front of the neck. So how, how much undermining or release of skin did you do in front in yeah. the face? So we, we lifted up about two inches of skin okay. around the ear and just lifted everything up and, and back. So that's one of the big differences that with a classical facelift that you're not adding these, these threads for suspension that you would do more undermining, especially in the neck where you would totally release this. So in your mind, can, can Debbie expect longer lasting results? Absolutely, so this is totally different. It's not a thread lift. This is a way of placing a matrix underneath the skin that'll last five to 10 years. Who's the ideal candidate? You know, anybody Besides who's not me. happy. <laughs> <laughs> I would say anyone who's not happy with their neck, um, even younger patients who have sort of that ski slope neck are great candidates. Who, who don't have a well-defined exactly. crease in the neck. Exactly, and somebody who wants to see more of the angle of the jaw, which is a very popular aesthetic feature. Mm -hmm. And then as we start aging, somebody who's starting to show some signs of aging, it's a perfect, Can perfect Can I ask you feature. guys a question for um, the plastic surgeons? When do you know that you're ready for a procedure like Debbie had versus maybe a little bit more in just the contouring side? Well, it's such a great how, question. How you know I mean, this show, over the, the years, we've talked about so many options. The options out there now for facial rejuvenation are, are, are endless. I think, I think what's most exciting is over the last five to seven years, new technologies have emerged that will tighten the skin. Things like radio frequency, right. laser beams that we pass under the skin. So when somebody starts noticing that things are starting to sag a little bit, then that's the perfect time to do a little touch up to kind of hold things where they are. And that's well, what this procedure does. And, and everybody is, is a little bit different. It's, it's when do you come see us? Well, when you have something that's bothering you and you would like to improve for the right reasons, it, you're doing it for yourself, not for somebody else, et cetera. Then it's, and we see it. We have patients coming in 20, oh, I want a facelift. I need a facelift. <laughs> and that's the ethical plastic surgeon is going to say, well, that, no, you that's don't. Not what you need we're not right doing now. a facelift. Yeah. That you are not ready for that, but maybe you're ready for something else. Truly a great result. You look Thank you. Absolutely Can we, Dr. Miller, dare we ask the, the uh, price tag and something like this? Yeah, sure. The, the price tag for what Debbie had is around $25,000, and that's with skin removal. Now, someone who's a little bit younger who might want to have something like face tight radio frequency tightening with this Elevate procedure, then you're looking at about 10 to 15. Mm. Okay. So talk to your doctor and figure out what's right for you, Debbie. Thanks again for coming, Dr. Moore. Thank you. Thank you.